So Reloom just released a new tool that's going to be an absolute game changer for anyone who considers writing copy for your website or landing pages a little bit of a hassle. And in today's video, we're going to be checking out that tool. So without further ado, let's get into it. Hey friends, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we're going to be checking out the latest reloom release which is a reloom ipsum which is a figma plugin that will make it super easy for you to generate copy for your landing pages or even your entire websites while you are going through the design process now i'm not going to lie to you i am not a big figma user i am one of those degenerate people that builds straight in webflow but i do love all of the different things that reloom has created so i thought i'd check it out and let me tell you this plugin here is actually phenomenal i am someone that doesn't really enjoy the process of coming up with copy for my landing pages or websites but having seen how this tool just instantly creates copy for your entire landing pages it does show the value of potentially using reloom to at least sketch out large parts of your sites before building it in webflow so what we're going to be doing in this video is going over how this plugin works so we're going to start off by automatically generating copy for an entire landing page and then i'm going to show you how you can get a bit more granular so we're going to focus on generating copy for a specific frame or section inside of your landing page and then we're going to dive right into the individual elements that you can update with copy i'm also going to be showing you some of the other use cases where reloom ipsum is super valuable but with all that being said let's dive straight into it so we can see how it all works so first of all if you want to test out this tool but you don't have your own figma files reloom actually created a figma file that you can use to test this plugin so i'll leave a link link to it down below and you'll be able to see that you have a playground where it basically shows you what all of the different things are that you can do um, but you also have an entire site that you can use uh, to basically generate the copy now i have um, started off by simply um, using the reloom library figma kit um, that basically allows you to pull different components together and i'm just going to start off on the page templates to show you how it all works so what we're going to do is we are going to create a website copy for this landing page here and so if we go through what we have right now you can see it says headline that highlights the value proposition and so on so it's just all placeholder text as you can see down here um, customer testimonials are all placeholder text and what we can do now is we can use the reloom ipsum plugin and so uh, you'll have to install it first of all by just searching up reloom ipsum you'll probably have to hit the install button first but then then as soon as we've got that what will happen is this plugin will open up and you'll be able to see that you can add a company name and a brief description of what this company does now I'm gonna start one from scratch so what I'm going to do is I am simply going to open up chat GDP and I am going to get it to create a fictional company for me so what we're gonna do is we are going to say create a fictional uh, fintech company that uses AI to help uh, people save money. And so what you can do is then add a company description, a company name. Now, inside of the Reloom Ipsum Playground, they actually give you a recommendation in terms of what information you should feed into here. So if we go in here and we zoom in, you'll be able to see uh, where is it that it is looking for a short description of the product and service the company's unique selling point the problem solution and so on so what I can do is I can simply say um, include um, the problem that this tool solves the unique selling point um, three features and also who um, the target audience is and so what we can do now is we can just go ahead and create this fictional company uh, you can see here it's called save ai um, and it just comes up with all of this information here and what i'm going to do is i am simply going to take all of this and obviously this is just for this example but you can obviously also uh write out your own so if you're doing this for uh clients you can actually create a little form that you can then use to basically populate this field and so what we're going to do is we're going to just post that in here i'm going to call it 
Sav AI. And now that we have all of this information, what we can do is we can actually generate the copy for this landing page. And so what we're going to do is we're simply going to click on generate copy. And then we're just going to have to wait a minute or so for the AI to generate the copy. Now, while we're waiting, um, this plugin works really well with Reloom because it actually factors in the text that is stated in here so you can see here that it says headline that highlights the value proposition then you also um, see down here it says describe exactly what your product or service does and the AI will factor in all of those um, statements um, when generating the copy and now that we have done that we can see that our copy has been updated so you can see here grow your savings with uh, Sav AI Sav AI helps you save and grow your money with personalized saving plans and so you can already see this is phenomenal but not just the headlines you can also see that your um nav bar has been populated with text for example save now uh save now invite uh invest wisely track progress faqs and so on and so now if we scroll down the entire page you can see how each section has been populated with information that um was basically generated with the ai based on the information that we fed into reloom ipsum and so you can already see this is some absolutely game-changing stuff you can see here that you've got all of your different testimonials populated with um names and um job titles and all that type of stuff and so this is something that will really help speed up the process for generating good copy for your landing page as you're going through the design process now, as soon as you've created all of your copy, you might want to make some changes or regenerate copy for specific sections on your landing page. And so what you can do is you can now go ahead and simply select certain frames that you want to update. And as soon as you've got that frame selected, what you can do is you can click on generate copy. And what Realm Ipsum will do then is instead of generating new copy for the entire landing page, it will only generate new copy for the section or the frame that you've currently got selected which is super handy and so you can see now how it just quickly updated um, the description some of the FAQ questions and this is a really great way for you to immediately iterate through different uh, types of copy um, while you are setting up your page now another thing that you can do that is great is you can also update copy at a text element level so let's say for example we don't really love um, this headline um, what we can do is we can simply select that element and then click on generate copy and again what will happen here is that reloom ipsum will simply look at the selected element and then make an update based off that and so you can see here it just automatically updated of course if you want to just remove text make it a little bit shorter you can do that manually as well and the cool thing about it is is whatever you've currently got set in here will be factored in when the new copy is generated by the ai Okay, so one more thing that I want to show you about this plugin that I find super handy is that if you want the copy to fit a specific style or brand voice, then what you can do is you can go into the plugin, open up the advanced settings tab, and you'll see in here you have a text field where you can give the AI more specific instructions. And so you can say things like write the copy in the voice of um, an angry old man or whatever it is that you want to do. The, the easy way to illustrate how the AI adapts to your specific instruction is to actually just ask it to translate it so what I'm going to say is write um, in German and then if you click on generate copy and again keep in mind that you can do this for the entire landing page but at the moment I only have this specific frame selected it will simply go ahead it will again factor in the information that sits in the section right now and then it will just simply write it out in German and so obviously um, you know translate into the into a different language is obviously a very useful use case but you can really adapt it to um, give it specific brand voice um you know instructions you can add things like make it shorter make it friendlier those types of things and you'll see how the copy for a specific section or the entire landing pages changes as you refine your notes 
Okay, so there are two more quick little things that I want to tell you. So first thing is, obviously, Reloom Ipsum works really, really well with the Reloom Library Figma kit. So if you use Reloom, this tool will be perfect for you. But you can also use Reloom Ipsum with other component libraries. Um, so let's say, for example, you use the Untitled UI kit um, and you want to use Reloom Ipsum here, it works the exact same way. You just go ahead, you select your frame, you add your company name, your company description, and then you can just go ahead and generate copy and it will work. This works with component libraries, but it also works with your existing Figma file. So if you already have a Figma file for a landing page that you're working on, you will be able to use this. In certain instances, you might run into little issues with the text that the AI generates. But if that happens, what you can do is you can actually revert all of your copy to Reloom Ipsum. And I'm gonna show you how to do that in just a second. We're just gonna have to wait for the AI to generate this text, perfect. So you can see here how it's all updated. But let's say you're running into issues. What you can do is you can actually revert all of your existing copy back into Reloom Ipsum by simply jumping into the menu here, clicking on Lorem Ipsum Generator, and then clicking on Generate Lorem Ipsum. And that should improve um, how this tool works on um, your own um, Figma files. And so again, you can just go ahead, click on generate, and it will basically factor in the size of the headlines, text, all those types of things. So that's number the, the second to last thing that I wanted to tell you. The last thing that I wanted to tell you is let's say for example, uh, your um, copy is generated and you're happy with only the headline. So what you can do is you can say, all right, I want um, Reloom Ipsum to regenerate all of the AI copy, but I don't want it to update um, the headline. So what you can do is you can right click on the headline and then you can click on lock, unlock. And what that will do is it will lock your headline to stay as it is. And then if you go ahead and you select your entire frame and you click on generate copy, it will regenerate the copy for all of the unlocked layers inside of your Figma file. And so what I would expect here is for this welcome to rebank to remain the same but for all of the other copy to change and this is again a really handy way for you to iterate through multiple iterations of copy and you can see here yep this all works and that is how you can immediately generate copy for your landing pages in figma now the best way to experience the magic of Reloom Ipsum is to simply try it out yourself. And you don't need to have a huge background in Figma in order to use this. I'll be completely honest, I barely use Figma, but this was super easy to get the hang of. So what I'll do is I'll leave a link to the playground files that Reloom has created down below so that you can simply sign up and use it. Um, and then, yeah, just go ahead, have a play around with it. It's absolutely awesome. It will be a really great way for you to pretty much immediately create copy that you can then implement into your designs or your Webflow builds. So I hope Hope that this was useful if you found this video interesting exciting smash the like button let me know in the comments down below other than that i'll see you back here for the next video